All right, so we're gonna go ahead and do a quick video tour of 17109 Cypress Wood. As you can see, we are at the address. I just started, it's starting to rain. We have a front porch screened in with tile. It's a nice little addition, not very common. The house does have a ring system, although I believe the camera is going to go with the client. It looks like it's just set up for security here. Um, we do have the storm door in addition to the exterior door. Uh, every room seems to have a dual paint scheme. So looks like a light sand color and a uh, pink. This room has track lighting. All of the rooms except for one, I'll show you that, has laminate flooring. It looks like it's new. This is based on the laminate flooring that I found in the garage. The garage is on the other side of the front door here. Garage door. Here. Um, this air conditioning unit is incredibly loud, which leads me to believe it's old. It may need to be replaced soon. The laminate flooring I was talking about. The water heater also looks original, uh, as does the electric panel. Um, it is a relatively small electric panel, meaning if you want to add anything to the house, such as solar panels, wall charger for a Tesla, uh, hot tub, any of that stuff, you're probably going to need to upgrade the panel. Um, Again, we have the dual color scheme with the sand here and some dark orange here. Uh, the kitchen does look like it's been upgraded. That is granite countertops. The appliances all do look relatively new, as do the cabinets themselves. Um, we're going to go over here. We have the first bedroom with the green, light pastel green sand. Uh, ceiling fan in this room, closet there, we have the original bathroom for Mikey countertops, no upgrades there, although it does look like we have a, oh, uh, For the only room in the house that does not have an element, and I don't know why, they also are the only room in the house that has all white paint. This is it. Vinyl flooring. Alright, and then we go across the house to the master bedroom. Looks like they left some uh, internet equipment here for the house. In the bathroom, I'll show you that in a minute. The closet's actually behind the door. It is a relatively uh, decent size walk in closet. It does have some storage space above, so if you want to add an extra shelf or more storage, you could do that. And the master bathroom, relatively small, and as a Formica sink, and then the toilet is actually behind. They screened this in, and at the same time, they did the front porch. It's completely screened in, which is very nice, especially in Florida here. It keeps all the mosquitoes out. And the house or the, the yard itself is fenced in all the way around as well, which is a nice, neat addition. So, the only downside I did notice was that there is moisture dripping. It is raining, as I said, so uh, this may not have been apparent any other time, but. It looks like we got some drips here. Don't know if that's common. It might just be the way they installed the back porch. Um, but I really couldn't tell you for sure. So. All right, and that's it. If you have any questions, please feel free to let us know. We'll see you soon. Thanks.